Recently, it's been impossible to avoid 5G at MWC. Well, this year you can, because there's no show. And so the city and these train halls are eerily silent. But one project looking to make its debut for this year's event has still gone ahead. And it's all happening below the surface. And before showgoers even reached MWC, they were going to experience the super fast mobile network coverage on the underground on the way there. The 5G Barcelona initiative was set up to provide the city with the next generation of mobile broadband. It's currently available between four stations of Barcelona's train service, including Europa Fira, the closest station to where MWC takes place. But 5G isn't just available on the train platform. It's also available in the tunnel as the train travels, becoming one of the first in the world to do so. So let's just see how fast the coverage is down here. I was getting around 1.1 gigabits per second on average on the platform, but it was quite a bit lower when traveling on the train. The speed does differ between going down the tunnel and being in the station. It's slightly slower in the tunnel and it does vary. Sometimes it can be as high as 500 meg or it could be as low as 170. But saying that, you're still getting decent coverage down in a tunnel. And it meant I could watch a bit of click with barely any loading time whatsoever. But how was this achieved? Well, we waited until the train service was closed and the station was empty so we can get into the tunnel and check out the 5G antennas. Each set of antennae are roughly 500 meters apart with 15 currently installed between the four stations. The plan is to do this for the entire train network of Barcelona, but it's coming up quite costly. So there's no clear date when this will happen. But there's also another issue. Vodafone owns all of these masks. If other networks come in and say, we want to do 5G down in the rail network, <laughs> then will Vodafone share their masks or will they have to install their own masks? And so will the tunnels be just filled of, with masks from different networks? No. I think that the, we have to work uh, very hard uh, together with the carriers. We turn to talk to Vodafone and perhaps it is possible, of course, because uh, Vodafone is the owner of the, this network. You've just got to hope that they yes, say yes. yes. <laughs> we, we have to be prepared for this situation in the next future. But until then, this 5G setup will act as a test lab for companies to create and test their apps, both to improve the railway logistics and what travelers can do on their phones whilst on their journey. So it looks like 5G is becoming part of the daily commute here in Barcelona. But we did hit a little bit of a problem. When testing the speeds of the 5G network, we hit the data limit. We used about 10 gigs in about an hour. So uh, you're probably gonna to wanna to switch to an unlimited plan.